morning world it is uh, the Sunday almost forgot the day here <laughs> yeah so actually I did not want to vlog today but I decided be why not because today is actually BMW world that will be happening at Suntech and managed to get two tickets for it later so that is going to be pretty fun uh, in case you're wondering why BMW because Mini is made by BMW yeah not many people know that I think <laughs> some do uh, but yes the parent company for Mini is BMW um, BMW also owns a couple of other car brands but we'll let you figure that out yourself or I might actually just say that later <laughs> but yes I just wanted to, to, to vlog today as well to show um, BMW World later and yeah so now um, morning just gonna go pick Cheryl up first head for um, breakfast then have a rookie collectibles live stream in case you guys also still didn't know we do have a, uh, a live stream for rookie collectibles every weekend oh the rubbish truck is passing zoom zoom all right let's go yes Good okay. oh, morning. They're here again. Um, what's this place called? Oh, yes, it's called Pongo Nasi Lemak because it's just right there. So if you're here, it's just right opposite it. Yeah. So much more underrated compared to Nasi Lemak. <laughs> we decided not to live stream today. Oh. Look. So I parked here. But this Jazz, who actually has like this much of a lot to park, had to park so close to that. So when I parked, I just made sure I parked really close to him. So well done, SJK43799E. You are today's douchebag driver of the day. I'm the second douchebag driver of the day because I decided to park very near you. But screw you. <laughs> anyway, we are here at the uh, convention center to go to BMW Excitement. Yeah. We are finally here. We got checked in already. And uh, look at that. BMW World. And uh, that they even have a map. It looks like it's very huge, but I wonder if it is. Yeah. Then again, we've been to places like Tokyo Motor Show. So. Yeah, we are spoiled for choice. That's it. But let's go, let's go. Check back, check back. Oh. <laughs> it's Ooh. I also want an M5. Ooh. So right by the entrance, oh my god, so noisy here. But right by the entrance, there's like what defining moments of the BMW group. Establishment of BMW in 1916. That's where the logo comes from. It's a propeller, in case you didn't know that. First six cylinder inline engine, and then Cheryl buys one. And then so many. Ah, you see? You see? We were talking about this earlier, weren't we? So they bought it in 1994. Uh, ooh, but look at that, man. That's a 1937 327 Sports Cabriolet. Uh, wow. Launched in 37. That's many years ago. And that's an Isetta, man. Also known as a bubble car. The door opens up from in front door. Which is pretty cool. Uh, it is a, wow, check it out, man. One cylinder, 250cc. Or 300cc motorcycle engine. 9 to 10 kilowatts. <laughs> Bell race. Oh, look at that, man. It's the E39 M5. This is classic. The color as well, man. Wow. That's really cool. Oh, that's an E46 M3 over here as well. Oh, people are taking a picture. <laughs> uh, this one is a CSL version, which is a coupe sport lightweight. It's a limited edition one. They only made 1,383 of these particular variants, the CSL model. Wow. I want an M3. Look inside now. Ah, 
did he change the shifter? He might have. That does look like a... I don't know. Is that stock shifter? Maybe. But in any case... Oh man, check that out. It's a carbon roof. I could only lift the camera up so much, so that's that. Oh hey, there's a mini booth behind there as well. Very loud music and uh, but yes, these are more of the classic ranges, the classic ones, but lovely, aren't they? Yeah, we decided to come here to the mini booth now. So there's, uh, they've got the countrymen on display. We've actually test drove this, remember? Um, a couple of blocks back, or something like that. Oh, it's there? Alright. Okay. There is a workshop area where you can actually do your... There's some leather craft stuff that you can do. As a JCW Clubman. Which everybody should buy. <laughs> Where's Cheryl? Here's a more exterior view of the Clubman. So this one here, that's different from Jules, which is ours. All four. So it's four wheel drive. You got your BBKs. You got a pretty dope ass um, JCW side scuttle. Really nice. Um, of course, naturally the red accents, the JCW rims, the red roof. That's pretty nice. A JCW exhaust as well. That's pretty awesome. The one I really, really want is one of these. Check it out, man. This is the Mini Paul Smith. I think there's only a few uh, of these done up in this color in the world. Oh, wow. It's nice, isn't it? Wow, this is a very clean example, man. Can you guys see the inside without the... Not really. But still, holy crap. I want one of those. I do. Uh, there is... Oh, look at that. On the other side. So there's like a lounge area over here. Oh my god, the sound... We've got a mini convertible over here. Um, the, the new lights, back lights on the minis are actually really, really nice. But look at that, open top. Oh, look at that. This is nice. I really want one of these. Man, can't wait for the time that I can start affording one. <laughs> Uh, and then over there, we do have like, that looks like the normal Mini. I'm not sure if it's a Cooper or a... Yeah, it's a normal tree door. Eh. And then over on the other side, it's more of the BMW stuff really. We do see the i8 convertible. Look at that. Damn. That does look sexy though. Then again though, I ate. Same engine, same engine. So that's pretty cool, it's an i3. And uh, there is a new concept car over there. It's the X7 concept performance. I think it'll be the largest one in the X range. Or the largest BM that they'll make, I think. Something along that line. <laughs> but it's not like the X5 or the X6 is large enough already. They made it larger. There's a 7 Series over on the other side, over there. And over here, we do have the 8, they call it. So sort of like an 8 Series kind of thing. Um, wow. This is pre-production unit, not for sale. But look at that. Wow. It does look beautiful though, it's, it's mad long. It is a left-hand drive unit for now, as you can see. Pretty cool. There's some back seats as well. There's a very slight lip over here. Let's look at the back. Uh, it shows it's an M850. That's what the badging says. Wow. This is more of the BMW portion of stuff. Um, this is the new Z4. 
Okay, adjusted 50 cents. I have not driven a Z4 before. But this is the one. This is the um, third generation Z4. As you can see, it's a. Again, all these are pre production models, so they are still in the left hand drive. But damn. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, what you just have seen was. Nice. It's a 2 series convertible, we've got more 2 series stuff over there. Wow. Oh, M! Do you see that? Let's go. Oh, look at that, man. The most powerful letter in the world. I thought it was D. <laughs> Anyways, it's an M2 competition pre production unit. Look at the. The carbon fiber parts, the glass in the wheel. Look at the splitter, man. Those brakes. Wow. That lip, look at that. That's pretty cool. Um, Oh, I want one of these as well. This is the M4 or oh, the CS M4. Sold! Wow! There's a sold sign on the. Look at that brakes, man. Look at the. Nah, kid. One day, just not today. Nah, kids, mom. Not, not today as well. Look at the amount of sweet and and. Ooh, this is a nice color also, man. This kind of grey. Yeah. And again, the wheels are huge. That's the M5. Wow, we. I like the bottom coloring of the. Are we looking at this? You see that? Oh, that's really nice. That's kind of like the M colors. Um. Cheryl's looking at the virtual reality thing. Maybe she should give it a go. <laughs> Do you <wanna> try? Yeah, I don't mind. Alright, and here's the merch store for Mini and BMW, of which we have already gotten a little bit of swag for ourselves. Um, yeah. La, la, yeah. <laughs> It was good that they gave us like vouchers. Yeah, $20 so, but it was enough. Yeah, so we, we, we yeah, at least managed to make that. Uh, oh wait, hang on, that's not the exit. That's the... So yes, all in all, uh, if BMW will uh, worth checking out. It is free. <laughs> it is free though, yeah, right? Exactly. It's just that you have to sign up beforehand. So oh that's... really? That's in like all entry? All yeah, entry. all entry, yeah. Oh, you can, okay. I think you can show up like that, but I'm not sure what's, what you have to do. But. We all did though, we all signed up before. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, thank you. I like that. <laughs> she, she just passed this tote back to yeah. me and she says, Rich. <laughs> cool. It's a Job Central. Oh, Job Central. <laughs> the universe is telling me things. Oh, universe. Anyways, yeah. So again, uh, uh, is it worth coming? Well, I think it's it's more of a... You can grab the tote bag. You can grab the tote bag. Yeah. Yeah, that's Quite yeah. Uh, personally, I think it's more of a lead generation thing for yeah. <laughs> for BMW, an offline lead generation thing by yeah, showcasing. Yeah, yeah, fleet and stuff like that. You have to do a registration to sign up for this, and then, and even within the registration, they ask you what car you're on a test drive already. But yes, anyways, uh, we come one level down because Cheryl gets to see her. There's like a block shop, flea kind of thing. This is this is more of what it is, though. Check it out. Admission free, thank god. Okay, enjoy. Bye bye. Hey, no! <laughs> and how do you like your block shop fair? It took me like the whole of two minutes to cover it. <laughs> yeah, it's just like that. Look at that. Yeah. Behind me. Look at, do you see that? It's there's, rather there's sad. No, like, it's just really, yeah. There, so, so. so well, well, at least you checked it out. <laughs> it's a, oh, it's literally a job fair. <laughs> I used to think it. It is a mother hot day. Yeah, suddenly it got like super warm. Anyway, we are heading out for lunch now around the area and we are going to go to. Okay, 
we are here at Lola's Cafe. Uh, we we'll just eat this dong, which is uh, bangers and mash, two dongs, and uh, truffle fries. Mm -mm. And that brings us to the end of the day. Just finished watching um, F1. It was the Spa Francochamps, or also known as the Belgian Grand Prix. Um, but yeah, so that was fun. Not really, because um, the Mercedes didn't win. <laughs> Not a fan of Sebastian Vettel, but congratulations to him. Anyway, um, so earlier on, Cheryl and I was booking the um, um, our upcoming trip to West Japan. That's gonna be fun. Uh, hopefully, most probably, I'll be able to bring you guys with me as well uh, via the vlogs. Which is also another reason why I'm restarting all the vlogs and stuff again. Um, so yeah, let's just hope that, well, it would be a good one. It's quite a mega trip. I mean, if you thought the last one was mega, this one is also mega. If you haven't watched that video, um, do check out the previous vlogs as well. Uh, those will be fun. They, they were fun to shoot. And um, that, that was kind of like before I got this. Um, wait, hang on, let me just unbuckle that. This thing, um, which made life so much easier. Like I can hold things, I can hold the camera much further now. Uh, and of course, have it look more stable as well. Uh, instead of uh, always holding the camera like that and then it's always very shaky and all. Uh, not that now it's not shaky, but that was the thing. But anyway, thank you guys for chilling with me. Uh, today and watching this vlog um, yeah BMW World was fun um, and yes thank you guys for watching I will see you guys in the next vlog whenever that's gonna be thanks for watching bye bye